and then move the little toe down, down, down. Let's squeeze. It's five and four and three. All ten toes back up, guys. Let's switch them. Big toe, little toe. Big toe, little toe. Big toe, little toe. Hello, leg muscles. Big toe, little toe. It's five and feet muscles. It's four, three, two. Nice one. Have a quick walk out. Walk it out and out and out. Just a four, three. And two, step out nice and wide, 10 toes pointing forward. So we're just letting someone in, well done, well done. 10 toes pointing forward, let's take it to the side. Two, and three, and four, lift up and reach. Two, the corners, now this is the first flat back, so hit that nice solid core, and then slide down. Bending the knees, if it's quite early in the morning, and you kind of, it's the first stretch. And now start to pull the shoulders back as you come through to the center. Inhale, bend the knees, exhale, straighten. Inhale, bend the knees, exhale, straighten. Two more, and straighten. Last one, slowly stretch out five, and four, three, and two. Now fingertips on the floor, lift up to a flat back. Hips to one way, hips to the other. Hips to one way, and they should feel really comfortable actually, yeah? Just all these areas that usually be quite tight, nice tight hips. Let's try to open them gently. Four, three, and two, come back to the nice upside down dangle. And now start to roll your way up, squeezing the abs, squeezing the glutes. Shoulders back and back. Let's go the other side, guys. Here we go. It's over. And two. And flat back. And down. And down in the center. Again, we bend. Stretch. Bend and stretch. Two more. Bend and stretch. The last one. Slowly straighten the legs. Hold the stretch. Now try to focus on maybe you can go a little, little straighter. And four and three and two fingertips on the floor lift up to a flat back this time bend into the leg so like side to side lunges yeah so it's still the knees are rocking over second and the third toe so side 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 to side just the four three and two come back to center and scoop up <clears throat> and roll it up four and three shoulders back at the top at the top here shoulders back and two and now let's pick up the pace guys so over for two and flat back for two and down for two, center, roll up straight away. Take it across for two and flat back for two. And down for two, this time hands down, kick back to a plate. Right knee in and back, left knee in and back, right knee in and back, left knee in and back. Just the four, back and three, back. Last two, back and one. This time go into a little jog, a little faster. Shoulders right over the wrist without. So you hear me? It's very sharp breath. Yeah, exhale, exhale. It'll make, make you feel a lot better. In and in. It's four and three and two. Now resist, resist coming out of it. Just hold that plank. Catch up breath. Rock forward and back. Forward and back. Forward and back. It's forward and back. Just the four and three. Back and two. Guys, last one. Pike up to the downward dog. Shake out your head. Press one heel down towards the floor. Press the other heel down towards the floor. And then to walk it out, walk it out. Oh, that feels good. Now making sure you can't see any bit of your heels from this angle. So when you look, dangle your head, look back behind you. And if you can't see any of your heels, that means you're perfectly parallel to the feet and that's what we want. Huh? And press, press, and four, and three. And now every, both, lift, all ten, lift all both heels up and press both heels down. So go to a really quite a sharp triangle pose actually. Try to stick the tail going towards the sky, almost like sticking the bum back. Yeah. And then we walk the hands towards our feet. And then walk the feet towards your hands and step the feet out nice and wide, just back to where we were. Gently roll your way up, shoulders back and back. And then rolling down once more, this time hands behind the head. And then roll it back down. This time really enjoy that roll down. Distance opening up between each vertebrae at the bottom here. Soften the knees slightly. Body dangling upside down comfortably. Gently rock sideways. Sideways. Side to side. Side to side. Just one more hit of uh, mountain climbing. We're getting on with it. And four, three, and two. Hands kicking the floor. Stepping back. This time right knee across. Opposite elbow. So cross, 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 cross. Here's eight. And four. Three, now guys, if you're happy here, stay here, otherwise let's go for a jog. Eight, four, two, well done, hold that plank, rock forward and back, 
forward and back. Just four, back and three and back. It's two and back. Last one, hold it here and pike back, pike up once more. Find a downward dog and roll the hands to the feet, feet to the hands. Roll your way up and ready for the flow sequence. So heels together, toes together, chest open, shoulders back, adjust your posture. Inhale, exhale. Breathe in, well done. Last two, you have the ball ready or your cushion, or go without, heels turn out, parallel. Turn it out and in, turn it out. So waking up these glutes, these shiny leggings to be able to see, yeah. Or up into the glutes, just one turn out and in, off the leg. Out, in, four more, and back, three more, and back. Last two, guys. Now stay on that turn. Now step out to second position, slightly wider than the hips. Let's sit, press. Ah, I hope you got a nice and a nicer waking up morning playlist on. Go drop. Yeah, slightly wider than the hip. Yeah, you, I, you, you can even try to imagine a right angle. Just not any further. Yeah, and press, press. And Makiko, I know in ballet, it doesn't have to be a right angle. <laughs> it's a beautiful posture. So hold this straight line. And it's four. And now a little smaller, but more precise. Down inch, up an inch. Down inch, up an inch, down inch, up an inch, yes, down and up. Start to grab the press into the palms. So this active pressing really activate the pecs as well. Very gently, yeah. Here's five, up and four, up and three and two. Let's go deeper, deeper, deeper. Now the right leg is gonna move slowly, floating arms into the second. For four, three and two. Right leg up, it's up and lower. It's up, really stretch. Guys, double time. It's up, lower, and up, tap it down. And tap, up, tap it down. It's four, down, sitting, lower. I know it's surprising how fast it starts to burn. Hold that you up, let's sit. Go press, go drop, rib cages in. Come on, Anna, let's sit, yeah. Breath, and press, just the eight, seven. Really stretch into those toes and four and three and two staying right here arms into second and now step behind you curtsy step back forward side yeah slowly to start and side i'm staying on the toes if you can and side nice so back and side almost like a real curtsy yeah now double time it's tap and side tap and side tap and side and tap here's four more Oh, that, that supporting leg is it burning now. Just two and back. Hold it right here, guys. And let's go sit, press, arms into first, or hold on, go drop. The idea here is try not to hold anything. Yeah, press and press and press. Just all, always, if people are starting to get a bit confused with arms, a bit achy, to the hips, just as long as not dangling. And drop, now go even deeper. It's uh, one inch and drop it and drop it. So nice one. It's four and three, staying right down, hips pointing one way. Now squeeze, squeeze, squeeze. Yes, I know, no swiveling outward, just press. But that sheet is pulling forward while the glue is pulling it back. It's a beautiful, glorious move. And press, here's eight, seven, six, five. Not forgetting the front knee. It's still over the second toe. Yeah, four and three. Now, guys, hold it in the widest point there. Press, 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 press. Pulling it out in nice and tight. It's eight and seven and press, press. Here's four, three, a little bit injection of cardio. Now, kick up and step down to second. And kick up and step back. Nice and slow. It's up, down to second. Yes, yeah. up. Now faster, which will feel easier. It's up, sit, up, and drop. Oh, my bad, up, sit, up, drop. Up, sit, up, drop. Yes, up, sit, up, four more. It's out, down, up, and back. Three more, out, down, up, and back. Last two out, down, up, and back. Last one, meet me in curtsy again, this time. Reach for your cushion. <laughs> so from here, you can have it nearby or just hold on to the chest. You take forward, back attitude, and put it down. Yeah. So forward, back attitude, 
and put it on. Sorry about the lighting. I hope you can see enough. Yeah. And down. So again, both my hips facing the floor. That's even worse. <laughs> my bo it's as it's like we are up. The both of your hips are facing the floor now. But because the glue is working hard, my knee is actually pointing to you. Yeah. And now for two more slow. One more slow. Double time, guys. Up, tap, up. You see no movement from the lower back. So the standing glutes is doing a lot of work. Yeah. Up and tap. Just the four. Well done, Anna. Yeah. If you need to hold on, hold on. I'm near a chair. Yeah. Now stay up here. Catch your ball behind your knee. And now lift. Press. 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 Nice one. Nice. Now two different challenges. You can go really upside down. That's quite challenging, of course, but it's even harder in a way to be quite high up, but tuck under. So this leg never go in front of the bottom leg. It stay behind and press. Yeah, so in a way, I find that even harder, actually. Yeah, let's go. Drop and press and press. Or you can always press, press. Just the eight, seven, six. Breathe out. Hit four and three. Hold on here, guys. Circle, circle. Are we squeezing the cushion? Are we squeezing thin air? And circle, circle. Just the four. Remember which way you circle. Flex the foot. One up, one squeeze. Yes. One up, squeeze. Up, no squeeze. Nice one. For those of you finding it hard to balance, come as upright as you can. But the focus here is to keep that leg behind. Oh my God. Trust me, that is hard. Maybe harder than this. Yeah, two more. Up. Now hold it up and just squeeze the ball. Squeeze, squeeze. Activate the hamstring. Press, press. Now do not feel bad if you need to hold on. That's why we are, you know, that's why we are working out. And press. Just the eight, seven, six, five. You remember which way you circle because we're going to go the other way. Four. Squeeze, squeeze. Hold it here. Point the toes. Now circle. It's the same without the ball. But without the ball, you want to really squeeze the heel to the bum. Yeah, that's really challenging. <laughs> and it's up, circle, circle, it out. Just the four more, and three more, and two more, and one hole. Now release the ball, hold it back to the chest again, like the foot. Now stretch, bend. Again, you don't have to be super, super dramatic in your angle. Now the, so if your body is quite high, naturally the leg is quite low, yeah? And press, four more, sh back, three more, sh and back, last two. Oh my God, stay out there. Now turn in and out, parallel and out, parallel and out, and parallel, four more. Here's four, ouch, three, ouch, last two. And now stay on that turn now, final hit on this leg, press. I know the standing leg is screaming. Press, yes, but nice, and I can see that perfect. And press, we got the finisher here to finish before we go to the other side, press. Here's eight, seven, six, five, and four, three, and two. Now start to swing forward. Bend the bottom leg if you need to. Hoist up, standing split. Nice one. Now press. Keep pressing. Press, press. Go squeeze and squeeze. Just eight more. Eight. Now ready, point the toes now. Yes, beautiful. Four, three. Now guys, start to bend the bottom knee and keep it bend if you prefer. We tap down, kick. Down, up, down, up. Inhale, exhale, four, eight more. Shh. Breathe in, breathe out, navel draw to the spine. Inhale, exhale, four more. I'm dripping with sweat. And three, and two. Up, last one, hold it up. And then lift up to your supporting toes if you can. Five, four, three, and two. Come down to a nice forward fold. Oh, again, fingertips on the floor. Lift up to a flat back like we did in the beginning and just gently wag the t wagging the tail like a dog. Yeah. Again, gently release those hips. <laughs> Same thing to the other side. So you understand it without the ball is, or cushion, it's even harder in a way, guys. Well done. So roll your way up safely and let's go over. Nice. And step out. Well done. We, I have the wall here. Yeah. It's nothing wrong with holding on, especially it's quite early. And now go, go sit. Sit. Press. We're not going to spend too much time on here because we've done plenty. So next eight, precise drop. Seven, six, five. Yes, four. Arms in. And two, arms into second. Left leg up and up and lower. Enjoy the stretch. 
and lower. Dramatic. Oh, and lower. And up. Double time. Here we go. It's up. Low. Up. Low. And sinking the pelvis lower and lower. Four more. That's right. Up. Low. Three more. Up. Low. Last two. Now stay right here. Let's sit. Go press. Press. Go sit. Sit. For four. Three. And two. From here. Step back. Step side. Yes. Step. If you're feeling strong in the ankle, stay on the toes. If it's a bit wobbly, please do not worry and just go back on your feet, yeah? Back on the toes, double time. Tap back on the heel. Heels up, heels down. Heel up, lower, and up. Two more, it's up. Nice one, last one. Meet me in the curtsy. Now press, press, press. And everything else is like a statue. Press, press. If this is done perfectly, it is really surreal. Yeah, nothing is moving. But just like, shh, shh, it's not big. Yeah, for eight, seven, six, five, and four, three. Now, guys, stay in the widest point, little pauses. Again, barely visible. Yeah, can you sit lower? Can you mind that front knee pointing at the right toe, the second toe? Shh, horrible, I know. Well done, guys. For eight, seven, and sit, sit. Yes, four, three. Now, catch up breath. Let's sit. Now you're prepared for that quick kick. Out five, four, slow to start, and two, and one from here. It's out into second, yeah. Slow is harder, so be, does not have to be high. Just lift up and step down, yes. Oh, my ball. And let's go faster. Here we go. Kick out, step, up, low. Now it's up, down, up. This is a lot of core stability for the standing side. Shh. And low. Four more. Shh. And up. Knowing me, even if I can see, I know I will step on it and fall down. Last two. Up. Shh. And last one. Now meet me in curtsy again, wait right here. And now holding the ball and you're ready. Yeah. Go drop. Drop. Or you can just leave it until you're ready. Now we're going to live in four, three, and two from here, guys. It's up and lower yeah slowly to start so you get your posture get your positioning and get that standing leg and see how you are today with that leg one more up and lower see hips are both facing the floor double time guys here we go we up tap so the back is not the lower back is not doing anything there devil yeah and for us uh, your hand sitting comfortably in there last two now stay up there, guys. And here is where you get the cushion. And now lift, press, pull my back, and press. Yes, press, press, press. That's it. And for the very, very advanced in bar, we're really used to it. Challenge is to maybe tap under, keep the leg behind the supporting leg. So this looks more upright. It's actually a lot harder, I find. A lot harder than this. Yeah, press. It's eight, seven. Pressing up and up. It's four, three. Hold it here, guys. Now circle. And circle, circle. So don't worry about the height. Come up even higher. But this bottom leg is behind the top leg. Now this is so the important part. Otherwise, this is not, you don't feel anything there. Now hold it here. Remember which way you circle. Flex the foot. One lift, one squeeze. So without the ball, one lift, one squeeze. Lift, squeeze. Yeah, lift and squeeze. It's a lot of back of the legs. I know, and now hold on, hold on if it's really bothering you. Not a problem. You hold, you let go as much as you can and go back to hold if it's beginning to distract you. And lift, two more. It's lift, squeeze. Last one, hold it up and just squeeze, just squeeze. Not, you still turn out. Yeah, just squeeze, squeeze. From the hip socket and press. Here's eight, seven. So you're not parallel, you turn out, both four. And squeeze. Now point the tools. Circle the other way. Shh. And shh. so if, if you're up against the wall, well done, everybody. Keep going. So if you're up against the wall, this working leg doesn't touch the wall. Yeah. And press it for four and three. Oh my God. Now remove the ball, everyone. Hold it to the chest. Let's stretch, bend, stretch, bend, stretch. It's all turned out for now. And four. Ah. Three, oh, and two, 
and now keep it there. We turn in, out, in, unbearable, in, out, yes, out, just the four, yes, and three, and out. Last two, oh my God, last one, guys, on the turn up, now press, press. You do not have to be high to really feel, oh my God, press, press. Here's a this shiny legging. I have nowhere to hide yet. For eight, seven, six, five, guys. We're to the floor. Four, three, and two. Hold and start to bend the both leg and send yourself down. Nice. And then starting with just a little poses, go lift. The closer the hands are to the feet, the harder. In the beginning, you're welcome to go to like a downward dog if you really prefer. If it's just a little more, a bit more accessible. Five, four, three, and now everyone, if you're in downward dog, walk the hands closer to your feet. We bend the bottom leg, you tap down and lift up. Go on back more. Up, inhale, exhale. Breathe in, breathe out. There's four, and three. Find your range, find your movement. Last one, hold it up, and now lift up onto your toes to hold. Final finish, eight. Come on, up, 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 up. yes, and four, three. Two, nice one, step down, nice forward fold, well done. And we're gonna get down. So move the ball to one side, and then we do the giraffe walk, uh, whilst letting the back have a chance to settle down. Bend the knee if you need to, let's walk it. But <laughs> the gorilla walk in Grace's case. <laughs> long body, quite long arms, and <laughs> quite short legs. <laughs> but it's just meant to be fun, yeah? So Anna, with your really long leg, you might need to bend the legs a bit. And that would be more like a giraffe. And my Kiko is a ballet dancer, so it's just a giraffe. <laughs> and Jackie, I can't see you. And walk it five, four, three, and two. Nice one, guys. Let's be down the mat to finish. Yeah. So I'm moving. <laughs> so again, this angle from the floor. Grace has nowhere to hide again. <laughs> so here we are. Hi, guys. Oh, this is nice. It's like I'm uh, it's like, uh, lying down in the studio with you guys. So before we go to all planks and crazy, let's get on with, actually, let's get on with planks. So here we are, rocking forward. Actually, get on with all fours. And then have a few cat cow inhale, exhale. If you get a sense of that pushing away, lifting of the core, really lengthening. Inhale, arch, exhale, round. And now that two extreme arches and round, you come to your neutral spine. Now try not to tuck, try to hold neutral. You lift the belly button, lift your pelvic floor, float the legs up. So try not to tuck, yeah. Float your legs up and hold it here. Feeling strong, one arm is up and down. The other arm is up and down. And one arm is up, try not to lean sideways. Yeah, the other arm is up. <laughs> one more, one more, yes, and that's looking good up. And lower. One more up. Now hands down, feet back, nice long plank. We're not gonna be here for long, but you gotta do a few of this. Up and press, right leg up and up. Just the eight, seven and six, nice one. And four, three, from here guys, let's go, curl it in and stretch and lift and low. One bend and stretch, one lift and low. One bend and stretch. And the second one is a straight leg, yeah? One bend and stretch and lift. Two more. It's one curl, one lift. One more curl. Now my combination, the favorite guys. Now we keep the knee bent, touch the knee all the way to the mat. Lift up and stretch and bend. So knee touch the mat and lift up. Nice and stretch. Double time guys, just four of these. It's down, up, stretch, bend. Inhale, exhale, inhale, exhale. Two more, Shh. up, well done guys. Last one and up, stretching the leg, flip the leg behind you and you're on your side. Let's just get the planks in. So here we go, leg out 45 degrees. We know this by now, yeah? Go lift, low, lift, low, and lift, low, and lift, low. Nice one, the stronger you are, the more you flip onto your side. So you really, really challenging. The most challenging part really is the bit you're on. It's quite painful, yeah? And two more. Now weight in the highest point. Hold it five, 
reach your pelvic floor. And now little poses, press, press, yes. This is a lying down in the gym with you guys. This is nice. Press, just the four, three, hi Jackie. Hold it here and circle. And circle, nice. I don't mind telling you, I'm just using your abs to pull the legs up now. Because for some reason, the inner side is really not doing much right now. Shh. Inhale, one more circle. Shh. Hold it at the top here, high as you can. Move the hip right over to the, uh, over the other hip. And five, four, three, and two. Now press, press, press. And it's eight, seven. And squeeze, squeeze. It's four, three, and two. Hold and circle the other way. I say that, am I doing it? Am I doing the same way? <laughs> Circle it. And four, and three. Slow as you can. Slower, the less chance to cheat. Nowhere to hide, hold it up guys. Hold it nice and still. Hold the abs in. And five, four, three, and two. Nice one, floating the legs, come up to your elbows, shoulders open, and without sinking ever to your side. Using this top arm to keep that knee out, or just simply drag that to look pretty. We come in <laughs> and stretch. So ready, yes, in. No movement in that middle. It's, all, it's as straight as you are sitting up. All that's happened is you lean sideways. Last two, and out. Now we'll go a little faster to gently release the inner side. Here you go, in, out, in, and out. Nice, in, shoulders away from the ears for four, out, three, out, last two, Shh. hold it right here, the favorite, we stretch, bend, stretch, bend, stretch, knee stay right where it is, and bend, and stretch, and bend, four more up, and bend, three more up, and bend, two more, now comes the crunch, hold it there guys, now crunch, and release, one more slow, exhale, and return back to neutral, double time, squeeze, release, squeeze, Release, squeeze, release, and squeeze. Four more, and four. Next bit, either stay here or come to side plank. And hold it here in four, three, and two. Hold on and lift up. So it's an L-shaped side plank. It's a side plank, basically. Now either hold here and just enjoy a little poses. Otherwise, reach, release. So are you missing the days when we had a bent leg? There's the bent leg version. Yeah, reach. Otherwise, straighten that back leg. It's up, release. Up, last four. And three. Yes, last two. Guys, wait here. Five, four, three, two. Nice one coming. <laughs> well done, press back. Oh, little rock side to side. That's really comfortable. Ready for the other side. <laughs> little wiggle, wiggle, wiggle. Before we go though, sit back, <laughs> tricep, well done. A little tricep, a little resting in the arms. We're not going to do that much tricep, don't worry. But there was, you know, the plank to compensate from here, lift up the bum slightly, not ready. Once, always a reminder, open shoulders back, yes? And now, we sitting down, stretching up, yeah? And down, and up, that whole time, it's down, up, down. And there's a lot of movement in the across the shoulder blades down and up, yes, down, up and down, up and down and up. Well done, guys. Here's four more. It's down and up and down, up. Last two. And now either stay, we'll stay halfway and your poses drop and press. That's the eight, seven, six shoulders away from the ears. Come on, away from the chest. Four, three. Now either come up to a flat tabletop or straighten the leg, come up to reverse plane. 10 toes pointing at the floor. Either stay here or develop play one leg, put it down, develop play the other leg. Or just stay there. One more, develop play. And the other one, develop play. Working that glute lift up and slowly float down. Well done, guys. And well done now, here you go, right here. Now, well, well done, nice. Now, it's come back to a nice neutral spine. From the waist down, you start to tuck. 
when you get to a certain point, you start to straighten the spine. Yeah. So it's not the C curve, it's a straight, nice and neutral, and then bending the legs in. We got one leg, lower, the other, and lower. One leg, and lower, four more. Two each side, go up, release, rest your arms, rest your arms, well done guys. Now for some of you, this is too easy, arms by the ear. Double, legs up, lower, up and lower, exhale. I swear this is like a double shot of espresso. I'm dripping like crazy, <laughs> up, lower, last two. Nice one, stay up here, hold it here. Arms by the ear if you can, and now reverse, down and up and down. <laughs> And up and down. Well done. Inhale, exhale, and down and up and down and up. Two more down. Nice one, guys. Now, to both legs if you want. Otherwise, just stay on the single leg. Down, up, down, and up and down. Come on, four more. Inhale, exhale, squeeze the pelvic floor. Yes, last two. Now, way up here, everybody. Hold it here. Five, four, three. And to bring the elbows down and lengthen back. There you go. So here you go. So the elbow should comfortably touch the mat and reach back up. Now, so right down. And then maintaining the angle, lift the arms by the side. Turn the palms out. We swan on the arms <laughs> just for a bit of fun. And out to finish off. Yeah, out. That's it. And you should be able to have those elbows grazing the floor every time. That's how low it should be, guys. It's eight, seven, six, five, and four, three, and two. Oh my God, whoa, pull yourself up. And then go, Grace, what was that? Well done. Now guys, the other side. Let's roll. <laughs> so the arms had a nice break. Oh, and now you see the plank has been cut really short. It's cut really short, so here you go. <laughs> Let's say so. Now shoulders over those ribs, guys. That's the half part. Now lift. Lift, 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 nice lift, lift. That's it, squeeze, squeeze. Adding the hamstring curl in five, four, three. Hold it here, guys. One curl, stretch, one straight leg, lift. One curl, stretch, a straight leg, lift. And curl, stretch, straight leg, lift. And curl, stretch. Four more, like that. One curl, look, and stretch. Three more, Shh. Short, sharp breath, exhale, and straight leg. One more, curl, stretch. Now with the straight leg, you curl the knee in final finish, you guys, from here. Touch down, up, stretch, bend. Touch down, up, stretch, bend. Touch down, up. Anytime you need to, the other knee comes down. Yeah, stretch. Four more like this, come on, down, up, stretch, bend. Three more, down. Up, stretch, bend. Two more down. Up, stretch, bend. Last one down. Up, stretch, flip round. The top, top leg goes behind you. You're ready. Hi. <laughs> well done, everybody. So from here, it's up, low. You all know this bit. Yeah. And up, low. Just the four. And three. Hi, <laughs> Oh, Jackie, you realize you can only see ahead. Last one, hold it here, guys, hold it. Five, four, three, oh, yeah, pause it. Nice one. So isometry hold was a, bit, a lot harder than moving sometimes. Nothing to distract you. All we have to do is hold it up and enjoy the shape and going crazy. Five, four, three, two, hold and circle, circle. Nice one. Now I'm quite on a lot of my butt cheek. If you're right on the side, it's challenging, but you'll get a lot smaller circle, but a lot harder. Yeah. Now hold at the top here. No movement, no nothing. Just wait here. Five, four, three, two. Circle the other way. Nice. Jack, nice to see you still here. I was thinking you're going to have to rush. Well done, well done. Four more. Inhale, exhale. Three more, all in those ash. Last two, last one. Way up here, guys. Little poses to finish, squeeze, squeeze. And then the fun bit, yes? Squeeze, squeeze, squeeze. Just the four, three, and two. Keep that leg out and bring this elbow in. 
So it's right under the shoulder. Now come in and stretch it out. So not on the line of the body. It stays 45 degrees out. Slightly easier. <laughs> and now double time. Hit out and out. Nice one. Shoulders way from the ears. No, nice, Anna. Yeah, absolutely no effort. Ah, see the difference immediately. Last two. Nice. Hold it here, guys. Now you go. They stretch. Bend. Stretch. If the hamstring is a problem, then just slightly lower. Yeah, as long as the knee doesn't move from where it is and it's not. Yeah. And two more. Shh. Now the abs. Hold it here. Little lift to start. Press. Now, as you lift just the leg, you start to get this. This lift, yeah, press. And it's eight, seven, six, five, four, three. Now make it big, guys. Exhale, inhale, crunch, release, crunch, release, crunch, release. Just a four, just a three. Option one, stay right here. Option two, straight, the blade stay bent, come up. Option three, straight leg. Here we go, last eight, guys, here we go. Touch, release, touch, release, touch, release, touch, option, last four, and three. Yes, last two. Everyone, me, and five, four, Woo, three, two, yes. Well done, everybody. Why lay child's pose? Quick bit of stretching. And now gently just let yourself rub backwards and forwards. Very gentle opening for that inner thigh. Make sure your knees are not on the hard floor if you have sensitive knees. And just allow the pelvis to rock forward with legs and bring it back to the heels. Forward of the legs. Although, Makiko, you are so flat on the floor, you might have nowhere to go. Because <laughs> the belly does flat on the floor. Oh, well done. Nice coming through to all fours. Through to all down, we stretch now. So step one, lay forward. Don't mind which one you do first. Now, as usual, I step forward quite a bit. I keep my back nice and neutral. And I shift the whole pelvis forward. I don't leave my bum behind, yeah. So it's a release for the front of the back leg. And if anything, tuck slightly. So well done, everyone. Now that's like a balanced low bar thing. <laughs> Sometimes it's a lot more flow. <laughs> and then lean forward, catch your back leg. If that doesn't work for you, I'll just get down and catch this way. Yeah. Five, four, three, two, nice one. Now release the back leg gently and shift the bum back over the knee. Straight. Now I like to reset, so I come back up. Everything is square, and then I send the bum, like stick my bum back, and press the belly button forward. Right now, this front, this hip wants to go forward, and the hip wants to go back. It wants the hips to be level. That's the hard part. Five, four, three, two. Now gently shift forward into that second. Hands on the inside of the knee. Press it open. More, even more in the side, yeah. Now, I like to have the straight arms and then just rotate. Only because if the both arms are straight, you will be even the both sides. You bend one arm onto the elbows, you don't you know, they might not be the same. Nothing wrong with it though. It's legitimate. If people are doing it one bend on one straight arm, come back to center, nice one. And then smoothly over to the other side. Once more. <laughs> So I step the front foot quite a lot forward. I make sure the back stay neutral. And then I shift the whole pelvis forward. Yeah. I have quite tight hips. It's quite a common problem. So if I suffer from it, most people would. That's why I'm quite, quite fussy with this one. Because if the hips are tight, usually this happens and you end up going to the back rather than this hip. So you want to make sure you tuck the tailbone forward and bring it forward. This angle is clear for you guys, but I have nowhere to hide. <laughs> now sink, shift yourself forward, catch the back leg. And if that just look like crazy fairy tale, come on to the front and catch. How we use it, well, how we did it sometimes. Yeah, look at the both, look at you both. 
What am I saying? Should never give any adjust any modification. <laughs> Float the legs away. Shift, come back again. So hips are right over the hips, flexing the front foot. Once more. Both hips are completely level facing one way. And pressing belly button forward. Five, four, three, two, nice one, come through. And let's do our toes. So 10 toes under. Make sure that if you can, big toe and a little toe are pointing in opposite directions like your hand spray. And, ah, oh, knees down. I swear this angle is so clear for everybody, it's great, but I can't hide anywhere. <laughs> Everything is visible. And I'm getting better at this. We're right on time. Oh my God, after this, we'll be on time. <sighs> so excited. I will add some more things back in because maybe it means I cut many things out. <laughs> 40 more seconds. More than halfway, 20 seconds. Nice, Jack. Jackie, now Nick, your next task is try to sit back now. Yeah, try not to, yeah, I know. Even I do it sometimes, Jack. Just really sit back now. So you're right over the feet. I noticed because I noticed I was doing that. Yeah, so you do, you're doing well. Five, four, three, two. Good. Coming up. Shake it out. Do whatever you need to do. Let me just stop the recording. <laughs> well done, everyone.